This is a review of the CC Radio 3 by C Crane Radios. As you can see, I have mine with the carrying case to add extra portability and a little bit extra durability to it. There is a loop Texan AM antenna attached to the back so I can get even better AM reception. This radio is very sensitive, it has very good reception, but the drawback is at least for me, when I run it from directly to the power, electric home power, I get a lot of interference. Um, so because of that, I ended up buying two pairs of rechargeable D batteries for it, meaning um, it takes four to run it, so I ended up buying eight rechargeable batteries. This radio is very good on batteries. So it's going to run a long time before it needs a charging, but I, I, I definitely would recommend getting the rechargeable batteries if you plan on using this for like AM and yeah, even FM. It, it's just doesn't, it just has too much interference even when plugged in for FM. Okay, so up top it has an AM FM auxiliary button, a Bluetooth two meter weather alert button, so you can actually set it to receive the weather alerts. You can get those silent, flashing, or an actual audible uh, alert. There are five memory buttons, so you can save um, five channels in each band. The power button is also a sleep button, so you can have the radio turn off after um, a set amount of time. The tuning and volume knobs are on the right hand side and you can lock it. There is a clock and you can set it. You can tune it with these two buttons also. There's treble and bass. I really like the uh, treble and bass. It kind of helps. At least even the treble can act as kind of like a fine tuning for AM because sometimes it, it, the sound is so far out, you know, turning the treble up actually helps make it clearer, at least to me. Maybe I'm just weird that way, but it works. What else can I tell you about this radio? I've already mentioned that it's sensitive, but maybe too sensitive. Um, okay, well, the back has some jacks for... Auxiliary line in and line out, and uh, looks like some headphones. Here's where you plug it in. Again, the case does not come with it. I got the case because I like to transport my radio and keep it a little bit more protected. Back here is where you put the batteries in 4D batteries. You can plug in an external AM antenna that I have done, and then there's a ground um, switch, or a ground, where you can plug in a ground. This is my Texan AM antenna. It does help some for AM signals. I would recommend getting it. It just adds a little bit more oomph to your reception. Overall, I think this radio is worth it. Um, again, the only ding is because it's made to be sensitive with reception, I think the drawing back is that it picks up a lot of electrical noise when it's plugged into the wall. Um, so go ahead and get it. Overall, good radio.